we're gonna try something here for the uh, YouTube channel. Uh, Sim Caesar is streaming right now. We're doing this uh, D10 uh, VFR flying for Unvatsim for an event. And uh, so we're gonna join him. I have his channel muted, but you're gonna hear him uh, quite often because uh, I'll turn that on when I'm when I can. And uh, so we'll hear, we'll hear that going too. But because uh, otherwise, if I comment or laugh at something, it won't be you know unknown as what's going on he's doing his intro right now so um we're gonna do a number of these little vfr fields on vatsim class delta to class delta and uh i'm gonna show on the map here uh what we're looking at just uh bring this up here so this is we're starting off here at uh, fort worth sphinx and uh fws I thought that said springs but i guess not uh <laughs> sphinx and uh, so you can see here the the outline of the delta is this right here underneath the shelves of the bravo for dallas fort worth and we're going to try and stay out of the bravo uh the bravo elevation goes up to but not including 3,000 feet that's what that minus symbol means right there so uh if we go if we were to cruise at, if we were to be at 3,000 feet we would be outside the delta but uh 2,999 feet where we're in the delta and we're going to go here for the first one Arlington Regional Muni it's a little tiny sorry Arlington Muni not Arginal Regional, Regional Muni and uh, just a short little flight over but we got to stay outside the Bravo so the shelf right here as you can see is depicted here 110 it goes from 3,000 feet up to 110 well, 110 11,000 feet uh, so we got to stay below 3,000 basically. The shelf of the this delta, the uh, not the shelf, but the uh, ceiling of this delta goes up to up to but not including 2,000 feet. So we're going to plan to cruise right around 2,500 so we stay below these shelves. This here, the shelf is uh, 5,000 feet. This one is 4,000 feet. This one's 4,000 feet. So 2,500 feet keeps us below the Bravos. And uh, then we'll have to uh, uh, jump down to uh, below 2,000 to get into the class Delta and get permission to land. So basically we just talked to these guys. We're under Delta's, their tower control until we get out of here, which is about four miles or so, four to five miles away. I think they're about four generally is that they extend from uh, the field. And then uh, we'll shortly be uh, contacting uh, Arlington Muni here on a 128.625. These guys should be on uh, 124.625. So that's the first run we're going to do. And like I said, he's uh, he's doing his intro right now, so it might be a little bit. I'll uh, try and edit and splice this together as we go. Uh, if uh, Or I might just put it up as an as in its entirety. I don't know. We'll see. But that's the plan. So I'm going to keep that around just so I can see it. I've uh, I've gotten the uh, on the little GPS here. I've gotten a, uh, a, a little magenta line there to uh, to find us. And uh, we're just going to be uh, starting up the uh, aircraft here. So I'm surprised the parking brake wasn't set. So the parking brake is set. The fuel control is on. And we're going to go ahead and fire this up. The avionics are set to go. We're going to turn on our beacon and our nav lights. And I think with that, we are good to fire this baby up. So we're going to give ourselves... Oops. Let's get uh, fuel in there. And we'll pull it back just a little bit. And we're going to pull in just a little bit of throttle. And there we go. Let's hit the fuel pump to get us going. we got half tanks. And there we go. Fired up. Get a little bit of throttle here. I think our thing says we're on mode C as well, but why does it think we're in mode C? We shouldn't be, I don't think I have this thing on yet. Or do I? Oh, it is, it started in that way. Okay, that's why. Test on alt. Okay, so it starts. So 1200, we're squawking VFR. I think that's good. We, uh, we're information foxtrot here. The winds are 170 at 7, 10 mile visibility, clear, temperature 13, minus, dew point minus 12, altimeter 30, 30. So we're going to set our altimeter here. 
this is a, a nice little bug. 30. 30. There we go. And our audio, let's see, so we need to tune the uh, tower here, which is 124625. So let's go here. No, it's the same. Oh, there, he's looking at the ages. 124625. And then the next, uh, the next airport we're going to is uh, GKY, which is one two eight six two five. So we might as well tune that one two eight six two five. And okay, so we're on there. So that should be coming through. I think I've got this turned off. There we go. Radios, we're off on the uh, thing here. I am going to turn this down. All right, we're going to go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and uh, make the Caesar side live since we're waiting for him so you can kind of hear what's going on. So you're going to hear that cut in here in a second. He'll be kind of loud at first. I'm turning it down. Don't worry. Well, it's information. Oh, maybe so. not. He didn't say anything right that. All right, well, so you should know, be able to hear him now. It, this is what they say the frequency is. And we're on the frequency of this. Let's just make sure my controls are working. I can bring these back now, I guess. There we go. So here's what we're flying. There's a gaggle of people around here. What, get, get away from my plane. What do you want? <laughs> we're not going to push or anything. We're on VATSIM. I think Caesar. He's down here somewhere, I think. Oh yeah, he's he's further down. Oh. Wait a minute, is he? Oh wait, no, is he down here? He might be over here. I tried it on both radios. I'm not or I'm looking at his thing left. upside down. Let me see if I can pick up the. Uh Uh, let's see. They say what air, what uh, runway they're using here? No, it does not. One seven zero at seven, though. The uh, I should pull up the airport chart for this. That would be helpful. Navigraph. Oops. Oh, there we go. So it must be it must be because the. Um, Oh yeah, he's down here. This is another section of where it's kind of open area. But if their winds are 170, so we're probably going to be taxiing up. We're probably going to be taking off to the south. So taking off from uh, 18 over there would be my guess. So you'll have to come right by here. So that's cool. I'm not going to call up until he does because I don't want to risk Kevin to leave before he does. Uh, so, so yeah, so you remember I said um, I, I, I tried to use the frequency on the map and that didn't work and then they got a weird frequency in there so maybe there's something with this particular airport because I was able to pick it up from the KY airport. <laughs> KY airport? Maybe they haven't lubed the ATIS I knew that was coming. I knew it the was KY coming. KY airport, it's all nice and lubed up. I knew that was coming. Adis machine is working. I apologize over there. for him. <laughs> uh, All right. Okay, so let's put a direct to what? Oh, that's right. That's there we go. Oops, oops, oops. Uh, activate. Okay. Ooh, we have a magenta Lights. line. Cool. <clears throat> we really okay, need so those. It's daytime, but it's fun anyway. So this is our nice little Cessna 172. This is uh, the type of aircraft I actually trained in when I was doing flying lessons way back in the day. Hoping to get back and uh, finish that in the near future here. Am I forgetting something? Is there something I'm supposed to do on the stream that I'm forgetting? 
I've got a few different little views set up here. I'm just trying to remember what does what. Got some wing views. These are the uh, dizzy views right here. Not the ground I'm looking for. But also, you can see kind of from the back. This is like passenger views back here, but looking out the wings. Oops, that's not bad. There we go. Nine does nothing. So one is home. Two is uh, the the T cluster. They call it the T because the standard T instrument, the standard instruments of these four is the airspeed, Space. artificial horizon, your altimeter, and your uh, HSI, your hor um, horizontal situation indicator, uh, basically a compass. Space. So these three make up your main right, your main so, controls, um, and so they'll call this the T configuration. And then sometimes what we're here referred to as the six pack because it also includes the turn coordinator uh, and the vertical speed indicator. And there are six of those in this nice little box. Class. These guys over here are VOR radios, uh, so navigation here. radios for VOR, which actually I'm going to switch this elevation. over to uh, GPS because we're using the GPS uh, today for those. I'm going to climb to 1600. Uh, That'll keep us under the Bravo. 1600 will keep you well under the, the Bravo. Under the Bravo. Those are deltas that you're yeah, circling right there. This way here. But okay. okay, and I'll come up this way here. That'll give us a little bit of time. I think these airports are only like not far apart. Uh, and then over here you have your uh, fuel gauges left and right. Okay. We have uh, fuel flow and uh, exhaust gas temperature right, that's there. The plan. And then here we have uh, temps, oil temps, and oil pressure. Right, here we go. <coughs> Vacuum and uh, amperage. And then RPM down here and a uh, doesn't show RMI. That I'm transmitting. Yeah, I don't hear them. So. Power Cessna or. Uh, Cherokee wants to hear a Charlie radio check. It doesn't show that I'm transmitting. Yeah, right, I didn't hear you. On here? I did not setting. hear you. I haven't heard anyone on this tower frequency yet. Well, it's not. Oh, my uh, joystick's not plugged in. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I had my. Uh, I had my. Uh, Very special. My joystick's not plugged in. Stand by. This is why I wait until Caesar does his things. Okay. This is why we wait. This is how we do it. This is why we wait. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> Just make sure my butters are working here. Okay. Uh, yes, they I are. I hope this works okay. Excellent. Does this work? Let me see. Is everything okay? Okay. All right, this is working now. Um, this is why even in the sim, it's important to do control right, checks because so you never know if something's gotten now. unassigned okay, or, yeah, yeah, that's working. or okay. disconnected, right. and you you get on the runway, you take off, okay. and realize you can't pitch <laughs> or you can't Six roll. Tower, Cherokee one zero Charlie Alpha two right. with Delta Six ready for taxi Cherokee south or er, uh, east mountain departure. Two with Delta, Delta. ready for taxi Fox south or er, uh, eastbound departure. Does that work? Hello. Hello? Is that uh, Cherokee one zero Charlie? Panda Jim, hello. Planet Snow Light, hello. Uh, affirmative that, uh, Cherokee one zero Charlie. Uh, Alpha two with uh, Delta ready for taxi. Uh, affirmative Cherokee one zero Charlie. Uh, Alpha two with uh, Delta ready for taxi. Roger, Cherokee sure. went here, Charlie. Taxi runway one to the right. Yeah, Alpha Roger, Charlie. Charlie. One seven. Taxi runway one to the right. Yeah, Alpha Charlie. One seven right. There's no uh, one, seven. one seven right. I don't see a one seven right on the chart. Uh, one, Do I have the right? Three, one eight right. There we go. One seven right on the chart. Do I have the right? <laughs> one eight Charlie. Six, uh, Six uh, tower dash runway one seven right on the chart. One eight Charlie. I'm looking at the FAA chart. I see a 1-8 right, but no 1-7 right. Is that where you'd like me to go? FAA one chart, Charlie. I see a 1-8 right, but no 1-7 right. Is that where you'd like me to go? Charlie, you went to Charlie. Taxi runway 1-8 right via Alpha Charlie. 1-8 right via Alpha Charlie. 1-8 right via Alpha Charlie. Charlie. Alpha Charlie. Right via Alpha Charlie. Alpha Charlie. Charlie. Right via Alpha Charlie. Right via Alpha Charlie. What's your Charlie? He's telling, he's telling me 1-7 right. I'm looking at the chart here. I don't <laughs> see 1-7 right. It says 1-8 right. Maybe like some people see it. Maybe uh, most Sphinx Tower, Cessna 683, right. Mike Bravo, uh, requesting uh, taxi or takeoff departure to the east. 
with uh, Foxtrot. Uh, requesting uh, taxi or takeoff departure to the east with uh, Foxtrot. This is 683 Mike Bravo, Sphinx Tower. Welcome, uh, taxi runway 18 right via Alpha Charlie. 18 right via Alpha Charlie uh, for 683 Mike Bravo. Target 10 Sierra Charlie, uh, hold position, uh, give way to the, uh, Cessna on Alpha. Full hold position and give way to the Cessna, what's Sierra Charlie? Full hold position and give way to the Cessna, what's Sierra Charlie? Sam, we got, he's got a hold for us! Why do I have to get... He's just sitting there. <laughs> Why do I have to get... <clears throat> this is where I rank in the world of flights, and I'm happy to hold position for Moose. Truth be told, I'm happy to hold position for Moose. One chair, Charlie, you can follow the Cessna to the runway. Ah, uh, we'll do one chair, Charlie. Right, we'll see where <laughs> you, the the you will wait uh, for we'll me. Do one chair, Charlie. But <laughs> you should have seen me driving the train uh, this morning in Moose's stream. I was, I was very careful. I was very careful driving that thing. Moose kept telling me to give it more gas, you know. I was like, I don't have gas. I have wood. <laughs> oh, Sin Caesar. Get the core. Hello. How are you? Don't forget, everybody, we're doing a giveaway today! Exclamation point. Love the uh, taxi lights that are jutting out in the middle of the taxiway every so often. It's a nice touch. Thanks, Flight Sim. So I guess this airport has two runways and one of them is grass. Nice. Alright, so remember, we're going up to 2,500. Currently sitting at about uh, right. 700 feet off the ground. But as we come to this turn, okay, we're all queued up. Thank you for flying along. How cool. Moose doing GA. How about that? And Sphinx Tower, it's uh, 683 Mike Bravo at holding short runway 18 right where you go. Sphinx Tower, it's uh, 683 Mike Bravo at holding short runway 18 right where you go. Left on course approved, runway 178, we're at 18 right, clear for takeoff. Left on course approved, 18 right, clear for takeoff, Cessna 683, my brother. Left on course approved, 18 right, clear for takeoff, Cessna 683. Where's my landing lights and my taxi light? Where's my strobe light? There we go. Can't see any of those things. Speaks. Pink Tower, Cherokee One Sierra Charlie, runway 18 right, ready for departure. We'd like a Star left Cherokee crosswind. One Sierra Charlie, Out. runway 18 right, ready for departure. We'd like a left crosswind. Cherokee One Sierra Charlie, uh, hold short for departure traffic. Hold right. short 18 right, one Sierra Charlie. Charlie. Uh, hold short for departure traffic. Hold short 18 right, one Sierra Charlie. Okay, here we go. Doing some GA. Cherokee One Sierra Charlie, uh, what was your direction of flight? Eastbound, we'd like a left cross on the departure. What's your turn? Eastbound, we'd like a left cross on the departure. What's your turn? Roger, Cherokee, went here, Charlie. Wind 18007 knot. Eastbound and down. Proceed uh, left on course. Charlie. Runway 18 right, clear for takeoff. Left on course, 18 right, clear for takeoff. What's your Charlie? So he's giving us the left as well, so we're going to head over this way. Wow, this is the... This looks like somebody threw 
bleach all over this room. And we have got a, oh my gosh, a gift sub from a 310 flyer to the community. And it's going to Texas Fly, Texas One Flyboy. 310 flyer, thank you so much. How are you? Thank you so, so much. something weird in one of the updates with the trim wheels now it clicks all the time it's really not, I feel like it's not smooth like it used to be it's really kind of weird it's kind of taking the, the fun feel out of using the trim wheel away so all right here's 2500 is right here my so. trim wheel's not working oh no my trim wheel's not working oh boy I, I swear that man the sim. take him anyway my trim wheel's not working oh this flight's gonna be unpleasant 10 flyer, thank you so much. It's it's not that the long, community. Call yourself. Fly boy. I don't know if you're here, but if you are, please say thank you to 310 flyer. Yeah, it does readability. That's just my analog. Uh, well, I want to stop at 1600. That's my analog stick. If I have no. I have no. Well, I usually hide the yokes, is probably why. I'll hide the yokes. Anyway. All right, so we're just turning I on our no course trim. over here to uh, no trim because I didn't have the thing plugged in when I started uh, to uh, sim, so Arlington. I guess it confused FSU IPC. Maybe I can restart FSU IPC. All right, let me bring the throttle back here. And look at I like, the. I like, I'm now, I'm having to manually hold the nose down. To go far. I guess I could just go down here. And help. Help. So Arlington is. Uh, Free to change approved Free to change approved for 3-way Bravo, thanks. Have a good day. Alright, so we're going to switch over to Arlington, because we're going to be coming to the airspace next. Okay, are you going to Grand Prairie or no? KGKY. No, you're not going to Grand Prairie. Just Arlington and then going to Grand Prairie. Two chairs of the rest that are made outside the Grand Parade Club Delta airspace and frequency change approved. Just change through once you get the program. Oh shoot, where is it on my hard drive? Hold on. One, six, and three, four. Sorry, everybody. This is a dog's breakfast. And I need to get the ADIS yeah, that's for what I here. Think readability. I think it's on the C, right? Like right it's on information the Foxtrot. Right on the Ooh, C hello. thing. The C thing. And so they're going to be landing Seems probably like one six here first before I do anything. All right, I'm waiting for my. All right, come on, on the C thing. Uh, FSU IPC seven. Here it is. Again, we need to make contact okay, with them before we get to their airspace. So. Okay, it started. Thanks so much. Thank you for the event tonight. Thanks for the APC. It's working! It's working! Okay, we're fine. Everything's good. Arlington Tower, Cessna 683 Mike Bravo, five and a half miles okay, southwest. To, uh, uh, request Mike full Bravo, stop. 683 Mike Bravo, Arlington Tower, on our right down, on our way 16. And our right down, we're in one right 16 for 683 Mike Bravo. All right, so we established two-way communication, so we're good to enter his airspace. So I'm going to start uh, sending down here a little bit. His airspace only extends up to uh, 2,000, so we want to get down here a little bit. And then we're going to do a right downwind, so as we're approaching the field, we're going to make a left initially, and then it'll be all right turns to the runway. Don't know if we want to go down. want to go down a little bit. Let's just get it trimmed out here. So we're going to keep making a beeline for the airport until we get a little bit closer. We can kind of see it out here. Sounds like he's struggling. Nine miles. Okay. <laughs> Nine 
nine miles south. All right, so now we're very much in his airspace. We're below 2,000. We're within the uh, in the in the uh, space, three miles from the airport. Arlington Tower, Cherokee, one Sierra Charlie, nine miles south. Information, Fox Trot. Uh, we'd like a touch and go with a southbound departure. Oh, he's gonna touch. We'd like a touch and go. 683 Mike Charlie, Wind 170 at seven. Altimeter 3030. Hunter right base, runway 16. Was that for Cherokee, one Sierra Charlie? For one zero Charlie, affirmative better right base runway one six. Right base runway one six. One zero Charlie. Sorry, I'm to the base. I'm at a down one. Enter right down runway one six. What did he call? He called me. Okay, right down one. Uh, right down one. Yeah, he amalgamated our two our two names. All right, we're gonna start entering this uh, downwind here. Uh, Hoju, this is the TDS GTN seven fifty, far superior to the PMS. Six eight three, my brother, runway one six, clear to land. One six, clear to land. Six eight three, my brother. It is glorious. Glorious is the perfect word for it. All right, there is the gonna, runway uh, there. Go southbound departure. Where are we going after that? And K as we R go, K ribbed. Oh, he's K going ribbed. up there now. Okay. There Bunch of flaps. Obstacle ahead. <laughs> hey! Obstacle ahead. Obstacle All right. ahead. Obstacle. Toss. Thank you. I guess there's something there uh, that I don't. It's not in the sim. Could be a tower or something like that. Okay, we want to right down in for one six right. So we're on our right base at the moment. Start turning final right here. This is so much fun. And he's gonna touch and go. I'm gonna full stop because I didn't know where he was going next. And then we'll just uh, go off behind him afterwards. See moose on the uh, on the uh, on the uh, traffic advisory thing here. There's a truck waiting right there. Watch, he's gonna start crossing as soon as I hit the runway. What you wanna bet? Way here and get out of Sims Way. Prepare to come back. Airport in sight. Coming in on the 45. Number 683 Mike Bravo, taxi via Alpha to parking unit, made us frequency. Taxi via Alpha. Uh, taxi Alpha, we're actually going to. Uh, uh, Go ahead and uh, take back to the end of the runway. We're going to follow that warrior that's coming in behind us. I just didn't know where he was going next. One six via Alpha for six eight three Mike Bravo. Let's get our strobes off here and our landing lights. Arlington Tower, Cherokee, one Charlie, right down one to beam. Go ahead. Are you making a left cross of departure to Grand Prairie? And where is he going? Arlington Tower, I think I might have stepped on you. Is that for one Sierra Charlie? 
Affirmative, runway 16 cleared, cleared, cleared for the option. And are you making a left cross to departure to east towards the Grand Prairie or no? Once it's cleared for the option, we'd like a left crosswind departure once here, Charlie. I draw on the go, left cross to departure, Prue. Just remain outside the Grand Prairie Delta if you're not going there. I draw on the go, left cross to departure, Prue. Ah, Wilco, once you're Charlie. Once you're Charlie. This van is staring me down. They are... Let's see here. Oh, there's the end of the runway. Okay, let's slow down. Slow down. Laps. Dallas Executive. Cross, and this is the green highway. And everything's now green, you know? <laughs> everything's got to be green nowadays, you know? Let's see if I find out if that's where he's going, hopefully. I'm going to Moose, I'm going to go to, um, yeah, RBD. Perfect. Okay, that's what we got. Romeo Bravo Delta. worked out nice we got ahead of him so much that we have time to taxi all the way back and get in position before he uh before he lands oh which one's a runway which one's a taxiway well, if you look at the chart the you would know the runway. <laughs> whoa 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 I couldn't tell which one was the runway, so I just split the difference and turned final right in between them. <laughs> and Arlington Tower, uh, 683 Mike Bravo, we're holding short runway 16, we'll uh, wait Arlington to follow Tower. the, uh, oh, the Warrior. Oh, I see Moose! Bravo, we're holding short runway 16, we'll, uh, 683 Mike Bravo, we'll Arlington Tower, hold short runway 16. Hold short 16. 683 Mike Bravo, Arlington Tower, hold short runway 16. Hold short 16. Dallas exec is one two seven two five. Me okay. And do we have Plane any is issues? He's thirty thousand. We do need to avoid Grand Prairie, so we're going to have to take off and kind of avoid their airspace, this, this airspace right here. Okay, so we want to stay out of the KGPM Delta. We want to stay out of the KGPM Delta. 683 Mike Bravo, Arlington Tower, my left is clear for takeoff on course to the east. All hail Caesar! All right, 1-6, uh, clear for takeoff on course to the east, and we'll uh, avoid the uh, Grand Prairie uh, class Delta for uh, 683 Mike Bravo. I should have just requested a straight out. Okay, KRBD is um, Let's see. 16, landing or right. 661, Strokes. so we'll climb there up we to 1700. Okay, here we go. We'll climb up to 1700. Uh, yeah, I should have just requested a straight out. Uh, Last delta here. So that's not, I'm not going to be making a left cross with that shit. Arlington Tower Turkey 1 Sierra Charlie. We'll take a left turn at the river here. I didn't realize we're so close Arlington to the other Tower delta. Turkey 1 Sierra Charlie. We'll take a left turn. Arlington Tower Turkey 1 Sierra Charlie. I didn't realize we're so close to the other delta. Arlington Tower Turkey 1 Sierra Charlie. All right. On the up and up. Look, it's a wither. Oh, this is where having the uh, little GPS helps. Seeing all these airspace uh, changes here, I knowing the river, where the bet, like, boundaries of the, the delta is. Otherwise, you'd have to be uh, doing calculated uh, DME stuff to figure out where the boundaries are and know using your uh, sectionals and checking out oh, oh, landmarks and stuff. And GPS just makes it so easy. Warm in here. Let's turn on the fan after this next one here. 
think I'll kick the autopilot on once we get on course. A or B. Turn the fan on, right? Computer is put down a lot of heat. Holy crap. Like a space heater in here. the wheelbarrow in the high tide load of the stores and the wet swim the creek, put the wheelbarrow on the truck, you would throw across the bloody creek, whirl the wheelbarrow in and then go back and get another load. I'll fix it before tomorrow's stream, Peter. You have my word. I just want to make sure we're not going to violate any Bravo. This is, yeah, we're just, as long as we stay under 3,000, we're good. So we start to level off here. We're coming up to the river. Let's check this out. Start, kind of start the IFR. turn here a little bit. Just follow Breeze. the river. The river stays outside of the class delta, so if we follow the river up. Automotive brand, start to go a little bit higher than I wanted to. Tesla rules. Hello, we're doing that. The GA on that zone. Switch over now because we're out of the class delta to one two seven, and I'm going to see about getting the autopilot to work here. And where is my heading hold? I guess that's on. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go turn the fan on real quick. Executive Tower Cherokee 1, Sierra Charlie. Uh, we're uh, over Joe Pool Lake information Oscar for landing. Okay, that's better. One, Sierra Charlie, Executive Tower, welcome. And our right base from a 1 3. Right base from a 1 3, 1 Sierra Charlie. Charlie, traffic's off your nose. I'm not talking to him, I'm not sure who he is. Charlie, off Insight, one's here, Charlie. I'm not talking to him, I'm not sure who he is. Insight, one's here, Charlie. Executive Tower, Cessna 683 Mike Bravo, about five miles southwest. Tower, uh, request uh, touch and go. Bravo, about five miles southwest. Uh, request uh, touch and go. November 683 Mike Bravo, Executive Tower, welcome into it. Right base from a one three. And a right base from a one three for Cessna six eight three Mark Bravo. Number one there, Charlie. Follow behind the Skyhawk. Okay, we'll follow the Skyhawk. One there, Charlie. How's he behind me? Okay, we'll follow the Skyhawk. One there, Charlie. I don't have in sight anymore. I've got him on the. I've got him on radar. 
He's going that way, I'm going this way. Yeah, I need to know. November 104, pressure 1024, Juliet. Line way 13, clip stack up. Because we're going straight for the base, so we're not going to go to the downwind. Oh, there he is. There Wind, he is. I see him. Direct five. I see him. And actually, we're going to start dropping down here because we're going to be the world of hurt if we don't. Oh, yeah, there's the runway right there. Holy moly. Nice. All right, where are we going after this? Uh, KHQZ. Which one is that one? The moose in sight. K H Q Z. Oh, mesquite. Okay. Uh, and there we have a thirty. Oh, and twenty. Okay, we gotta. We're gonna have to stay below uh, fifteen on the outbound of this, because otherwise we're gonna have a class Bravo problem. Well, this this right here, uh, two thousand feet is Bravo. Got this at three. Mike Bravo on my one three. Let's see up. 1-3, clear to the option for Cessna 683, my Bravo. On departure, we're going to be uh, heading off to the east toward uh, Mesquite. Uh, oh, here, I, I am... I'm not currently dropping frames. I... November 683, Mike Bravo, roger. On the go, you can proceed on course. On the go, proceed on course for 683, my Bravo. November 1, Sierra Charlie, behind the Skyhawk from the west, really click the option, number 2. What is that noise? One three clear for the option uh, behind the Skyhawk. We're going to be uh, touching good with the parade on departure. Do we have a jet like hovering by us or something? Roger. Make sure departure. Number one zero two four. Julia contact. That departure one two four point three. No, that's on my stream. That's not Caesar. I don't know what that is. There's nothing. There's a jet like right up like outside my window. There now it's gone. That was weird. What the crap was that? Go up to 1500 this time. That uh, they get frustrated. And we're going to start heading off toward Mesquite. So I feel like, oh my gosh, I'm, you know, I'm going to lose some people if uh, my streamer And that was. So it's, it's for me as a streamer when I know it's buffering. That makes sense. Is that uh, HQZ? Mike Bravo maintain VFR outside the class Bravo for your tech crew. So Alright, we'll maintain VFR outside the class Bravo for this change of crew for 683 Mike Bravo. Yeah, 
so this one dips down to 2,000, I believe, that we're coming up on. So that's why we're staying at 1,600 feet. So we stay outside of Zabravo. Actually, it looks like we may not hit that one, but out of an abundance of caution. I did not want to <laughs> risk it. Uh, no, no, we will hit that one, yeah. The one over on the other one is surface, so we got to... This line right here, that is down to surface, so we got to we gotta stay on this side of the Bravo. But this one goes down to 2,000. Let's do this. Yeah, I will say, you know, um, this hand flying of and trying to do the stupid radio on this thing is kind of a pain. Favorite, the, the my that. And we're going to do heading. All hail and we're going to do one Emperor of Rome, ruler of the world. There we go. Ah! All right, Mesquite Tower yeah. is uh, 120.3. Runway 18, 36, so probably 18 again. And the class Delta, once we get this right here. So we're going over uh, Dallas CBD. <laughs> and uh, in the next uh, box here, which is this one, we'll see the the class Delta cut in. So we're within 10 miles now, so we could technically call them. I'm going to wait a little bit. Next, I'm guessing he's going to either go okay. up to TKI or ADS. So next guess. will be... Oh man, there's a lot to this. <laughs> these, these airports, I figured, hey, I'll have plenty of time between each airport to like nope. uh, prepare <laughs> for the next one. No, they're pretty close together. They're, right, they're like 10 miles apart each. <clears throat> uh, so after that, let's go to K KADS. Okay. KADS, and that okay. is Addison. All right, let me check it, make sure I'm not going into the, this problem here. That's super important. All okay, right, let's, uh, we're, right uh, we're eight miles. We're eight miles. We'll wait till we're under seven, and we'll call um, Zero three two here. K uh K H Q C. Uh it is information echo. Mesquite Tower, Cessna six eight three Mike Bravo is about six miles to the west. 
Command. Request uh, touch and go and departure to the north with uh, Fox, uh, with uh, Echo. November 683, Mike Bravo, Mesquite Tower, enter the right downwind runway 18, clear for the option. And a right downwind for one way one eight, clear for the option for Cessna six eight three one Bravo. Okay, information. Echo. And uh, so our tower. All right, so we're doing another downwind entry, which means we're going to fly at the field. Tower frequency for eight. This is so, I mean, it's so amazing doing VFR in Microsoft Flight Simulator because you just it looks like you're there. You can't do this in P three D. Or even X plane. I mean, the ortho is makes it better in X plane, but oh at this low altitude, even the ortho looks kind of weird. I mean, you're three dimensional, and it's all Off accurate. MTV, one, like, two, three. <laughs> that's the actual layout of the neighborhood right there. The roofs of the houses actually look like. I mean, it's it's insane. Off. Coming in with a thirty-two month sub at uh, tier three. Uh, Where is the nice airport? Here. Pop, I'm flying the. Uh, I guess that's this I'm flying the, uh, or is that warrior, the water and this is the jeep. That's the river, the because you can tell the vegetation running along. So this must be it here. Look at how nice this thing is. It's so nice. Ish. It's the same as like the Reality XP uh, in, uh, uh, in X-Plane. And there's a GA. All right, we're now entering their so delta. We established two-way communication, yeah. oh, so we can do that and not have a problem. That's fantastic. Oh, what a nice surprise. Boy, oh boy, you just made my night, Puff. Good to see you. Welcome on in. Um, so there's an event on Batsim, and uh, it's got 11 different class deltas that are staffing up here. So, uh, oh, there it is. There's the, the hangers for now. This is just uh, some weird. Which is, uh, nice to weird have kind of whatever. And so this is Mesquite Tower, 120.3. What did I say it was? 23, that matches real life. Turn the autopilot off. Let's we'll start it. our downwind. Uh, seven miles. Ah, uh, there's Bob. Blue Jenny, 500 bits. Thank you so much. Welcome, welcome, welcome. The ski right, tower, Cherokee, wants you to Charlie, I'm seven miles uh, west for landing with uh, Echo. Cherokee, wants you to Charlie, seven miles. Ski tower, enter the right downwind runway 18. You're following the setup at 132 midfield right downwind. Runway 18, clear for the option. Center right down on runway 1818 18 cleared for the option. We're looking for the Cessna 1 Charlie. Center right down on runway 1818 18 cleared for the option. We're looking for the Cessna 1 Sierra Charlie. Aw, oh, Puff, how nice to see you. And Flu Diddy 500 bits. Thank you so much. Alright, coming in over here. Look how cool this thing is. This should put us um, in good position for a 45 here. And Scotty is here. Scotty, good to see you. Scotty, hey, Scotty is here. how you doing? Buff is here. Hey, Scotty, how you doing? Who is that? <laughs> the ski tower knows uh, Scotty. Who's that? Who's is that? That's Who's watching the stream? After the completion of the touch and go, make a left downwind departure. After the touch and go, left downwind departure for system three, three Mike Bravo. After the touch and go, make a left downwind departure. After the touch and go, left downwind departure for system three Mike Bravo. That's exactly what we want, a left downwind departure. Yeah, who is Mesquite Tower? Okay, before we land, we gotta do something real quick. I don't know. It's very important. The name doesn't look it's familiar. Critically important. No Scotty, though. We gotta do this before we land. Alright, stand by. Oh gosh. You guys know anything about Sim Caesar's channel? This will sound familiar. <laughs> this is the Puff MTD theme he's playing. I hope I don't get the YouTube strike for this. <laughs> Lift off. All 
All right, left downwind departure means we're going to turn left crosswind and left downwind once we get to the end of the runway here. There's the wind sock. We'll stay at 1500 just because that's nice and safe. Oh, Pop. Man, man, oh man, so happy to see you. Let's start our turn here. Repeating wind 1005. I'm sorry, Mesquite Rim, 1505. I'm sorry, Mesquite Rim, 1505. So there's the left crosswind. And we'll give it a little bit of distance here. So we've got that uh, Sim Caesar and his warrior coming down. We don't want to uh, get too close to him, even though he's landing on the runway. So we'll go out a little bit, and then we'll start our left end. Okay, coming into here. Mesquite. We can start to level off here, because we're... Hitting our 1,500. Then I gotta consult the chart here and find out where I'm gonna make, make sure I'm not gonna hit any Bravos unexpectedly. Katie's alright, hello, welcome. chart here as we take off from Mesquite. Uh, we are good under the Bravo shelf, which is Bravo traffic is in the right base, runway 18 of the Cherokee at about a thousand. Uh, should be no faster for some check proof and for flight. All right, well, keep an eye out for the Cherokee and uh, free change approved. Thank you. 683, my Bravo. I think that's him. Oh, there he is. There's, there's Sim Caesar right there. We got him. They're coming in on the base. So we're going to Addison, and uh, so we're clear. The shelf is 4,000 here, but uh, we're going to have to scoop up. That's 2,500 there. there. Charlie, you're going to be full stop for departure. That's 2,000 oh, there. Uh, we'd like a uh, touch and go with left downwind departure. What's here, Charlie? I think we're just going to keep going north for a little sure, bit here. Charlie, uh, approve. Like make a, a left downwind departure, departure on the one eight. Clear for the option. And uh, we're going to do uh, that because if you look at the chart here, we have to be careful of this, this, sorry, this right here. So we're taking off this way. This is that water. Um, I think once we get to this little jut out here, we can then make a direct over and avoid this area. Because this right here is 2,000, but this is surface. So we can't, we can't cut this corner or we'll be in the Bravo. But at 1500, we're below the 2500 shelf here. We're below the 3000 shelf here. This is a 2000 shelf, so we're we're safe no matter what, as long as we don't cut that corner. So once we get to that little landmass there, I think we're good. Which I think is this right here. I do think you need to put the fuel pump on. I want to have been doing that. Spire 181 coming in with a two sub. Spin over a little bit and aim for that landmass, so and from that landmass we'll go direct. So direct is, I've already forgotten, what is the uh, ADS? Okay, ADS, it's going to be a little further over. Whoops, direct to... Quite yet, because I think that will cut us funny. Okay. We're gonna wait till we get right to here. <laughs> so I'll just oh, put that really in a second. Ah! It's just so. It's just so. Uh, so you got no time. But there's so many airports that you got. There's. They're so close together. I can't believe there's so many class. It's not that frantic. I mean, it is short, but I mean, as long as you. This is why I looked. I, st I spent time so studying the uh, the class Bravo chart ahead of time, so that way I would know. Hey, in general, there's what am I? What uh, shelf am I safe under? And so, okay, so we're going to go ahead and go direct now. So that is, oops, direct to... Oh, thank you again for the reset. Tier 3. There we go, and spin it over there. Uh, Peter, um, I'm thinking about going out to... I'm not sure. Should I go out to KTE? 
You said you're going to ADS. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so right after. Make sure he's not uh, screwing me here. All right, um, what's uh, the frequency for... Where's my... For Addison. Addison is... Oh, 1260. Oh my gosh. Puff just gifted 50 subs. Holy crap. That is insane. That's a lot of subs. Turkey 1 0 Charlie for extended crew. Good flight. Appreciate date approved. Uh, thanks so much for the ATC and the event tonight, Monsieur Charlie. Oh, thanks for flying. Appreciate date approved. Uh, thanks so much for the ATC and the event tonight, Monsieur Charlie. All right, one two six zero. What you're hearing right now, guys, for those of you that don't know Sim Caesar's channel, he's a, a bit of a Japanophile, and these are the little tunes that uh, the Japanese railway uses for their announcements and stuff, and he, when he was in Japan, he got a CD of this, and so he uses these little tunes for his uh, various levels of sub-gifting and what have you. Okay. Man, that thing goes on forever. Jeez, that's the longest gift sound ever. That thing is insane up there. It's almost like something like locked up. Okay. Um dang. Uh where are we coming here? Let's see. We're crossing. This should be the outside of that Bravo right there. It's getting hazy. Let's see here. Oh yeah, there we go. Okay. It's K A D S. I feel like I'm on a merry-go-round. <laughs> very pretty though I'll tell you that I'll give you that very pretty uh, 15 and 33 of the runways here and according to the ATIS information nothing that's very helpful uh, so, thank you so they're probably much. going 15 I although I mean we're not like leaving any area here I'm sure the winds are all going the same way with a 50 gift sub, uh, 15 okay. oh, uh, thank you so much you this is Addison I'm so happy to see you yeah, Addison Tower 
my gosh, that's incredible. Um, that's the first time the 50 gift sub uh, jingle has ever gone off. I put one in there. I'm amazed thinking, he has a 50 gift sub jingle. You know, in case anybody ever does that. And it's a four minute long alert. It's the longest alert sound in the history of Twitch, I think, but uh, it's special for, for, some, for a special event. Oh man, yeah, visibility's uh, kind of getting very, old. very, ah. very special person. Puff, I'm so happy to see you. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna. I want to read. Uh, Moose, I'm so sorry. I'm getting off track here. Moose will understand. Um, let me. Uh, I'm gonna make a turn here. I don't want to get into any airspace that I shouldn't be in here. So I'm just gonna make a quick turn over this way. I think we're going to do uh, a full stop and wait for him at Addison. Uh, of people that got gift subs from Puff. Puff, thank you so much. 50 gift sub bomb. And uh, first of all, I want to say this is an amazing. Puff has given 1,290 gift subs in the channel over the years that I've known him. And you saw him. He just came, he came in with a uh, 32. Addison Tower, Cessna 683 Mike Bravo. Uh, we're about seven miles okay, to the east so requesting much, full stop at uh, Addison. There were six, eight, here. three, um, Mike Bravo, sure out of the tower. Good evening. evening. Enter space, right there. Correct. And enter left downwind, runway 15. Okay, we can just go out this way. Enter left downwind, runway 15 for right Cessna 683, Mike Bravo. Out this way, we're away from all the airspace. Um, nine, nine, or Tango, who I, uh, Tango, who I think is here. All right, so we're cleared here. into the airspace. Uh, Mo, Daddy, That's all it takes. Uh, established uh, two-way communication. Sounder, uh, Even if he just said, uh, Roger, Cessna 683, Mike Bravo, the key is that he repeats our call sign. On this list. Mango 4519. If he was to say something like, like traffic calling standby, that would not be two-way communication. Yeah. Uh, would not count. Uh, Zomnoms, Sam Gamer 101, Killer Orange, uh, Demigo 97, Rob Valkyrie, ESPN 74, Speednut, Flyer Joe, Chai Town Sooner, Nomad Soul, Quantum Lotus, BW Flight Simulation, Rosa Van Winkle, Mr. Thou, B2, Freaky Freck, uh, Professor Wallen plays, Zachary sings, BXG Wipeouts, thank you so much, Puff. Uh, LOL Hater, Lopez Family Tube, Sheena TTV, um, a Ball Ars, uh, Exhale 40, Southern Controller, Steven 9975, Off Schedule Descent. Uh, All right, we're just about to mind, penetrate RD the official Class Delta airspace of Addison. Big Chief N, Kithacore 27, Deuper 68, Wiz Nation, which Fly extends Navy, up to, uh, but not including, 3,000 feet. Flaming Arrow 826 and Panther. And it's kind of interesting, though. There is a. Uh, of any of you, uh, of the oh, you know, it ducks under. That's that's what thank must thank be happening there. Up. So it extends to 3,000 yeah, feet, but uh, there's a part uh, of it oh where the. The Class Bravo shelf goes down to 2,500 right over the top, to, so uh, it must do the kind of little dip uh, under. You know this. Uh, I used to have the. Uh, I just it's used to have the single uh, sub little account, but again, we're at 1,500, so we're, over we're over, safe you know, no matter what. Um, which I kind of liked. It was it was kind of nice to hear that over and over. Um, but I decided to uh, so replace that, the sounds. Is that the airport there? Um, with just a, a different jingles for depending on you know the the. Uh, the uh, number of gift subs people gave. So I've got it one for like one gift sub, a different one for two to five, a different one for five to ten, you know. And I got another one for 25, and I and put Maybe. the 50 one in there, not knowing if it ever be used. And uh, and Puff just uh, Puff just did it. And thank you so much, Puff. A four minute. That's a four <laughs> four minute um, um, uh, jingle sound. And I didn't talk during the whole thing. I wanted everybody to hear it because it's a very cool little thing. That I found on one of my Japanese train uh, CDs. Uh, Japanese oh, wow. train CDs. We still haven't done a CDs, second so, round of the gift. Uh, okay. That's what that's what that sound came from. It's kind of somebody did a really nice arrangement of a Japanese. I'm still not seeing uh, the airport. I want to uh, make sure I see the, the airport before I start the, the uh, jingle the turn and, uh, here. We're about like two miles away really though. Nice we should see it. Music boxy thing. Is that this and here? I, I think thought, that's oh, that that's there. Really I'm gonna go ahead and go. Uh, I edited it down. I think it was originally like eight or nine minutes, and I kind of went through and edited it down. But I don't want to overfly uh, the field. No, suddenly. I didn't make that myself, uh, Slavadanks. I got it from. Uh, oh yeah, I, I see like the line. There it is. There's taxiways right there. I see. and sounds and like that, but uh, I did not make that one. But uh, yeah, that was the first time. It's runway one five. So we're gonna put the one five. Runway one five. Clear to land. 
I didn't want one to five fiddle in six eight three, three my problem off, but um, we'll get back on track here. Moose is waiting for me at the uh, Addison Tower, after landing, uh, we'd like to uh, head back to the takeoff end of the runway. We're going to be waiting for a, a warrior that's uh, coming in as well. Uh, the very kind T Bird 57 and uh, number 683, Mike Bravo. You said you want to taxi back to the, uh, to the end of the runway? Yeah, that's correct. Let me get back on track. Turn the other number 683, Mike Bravo. Uh, upon landing, exit, <laughs> exit to left when able, taxi, uh, taxi to the end of the runway via Alpha, there's a turnout at the end of the, end of the taxiway. Okay, we'll uh, exit left upon landing and taxi back via Alpha to that turnout for uh, 683 my problem. And everybody, thank you so much for your patience and uh, sticking around and uh, bearing with me here. Um, we're going to get back on track right now. Let me uh, just have the plane turn around, and then I'll turn the autopilot off. Um, okay, we're uh, 24 miles from there. It's nice scenery. I mean, it's Microsoft Flight Simulator. We have a lot of nice stuff to look at between here and there. So, uh, so Addison is 645 feet, so I'm going to climb up to 1,700, and uh, we'll All get right, there. So there Puff, we got uh, lead-in lights for this I'm one. I'm just so happy to see you, Puff. I'm, uh, so glad you're feeling up for coming by tonight. That's really special. What a night. What a special, special night. Thank you so much, Puff. Uh, let me say hello to everybody that's here. Texas One Flyboy, uh, good to see you. Flu Diddy, welcome. Oh, Texas One Flyboy got a uh, gift sub from um, from uh, um, 310 Flyer earlier. Uh, thank you for coming by, Texas One Flyboy. Um, and uh, Flu Diddy is here. Good to see you. Uh, did I miss anything while... Uh, oh, yeah, she's that little... Uh, Turnout, so we'll go taxi over there. So that way, if anyone else happens to want to come down here, we're not in their way. Was, uh, happening during that works the, out uh, nicely. During that, uh, so uh, yeah, yeah, Puff, thank you so much again. Um, make sure I'm going the right direction here. Yeah, we are. Um, uh, Fluidity's here. Scotty the hottie, we said hello to. Scotty, what a pleasure to see you. Automator, welcome on in. Tense Diamond, hello. Katie Zora is here. Uh, Eric Flyer, good to see you. KTL Rob Powell, good to see you. And Fourth Doctor. Uh, thank you for coming by. All right, uh, let me get the autopilot off, and we'll get back to hand flying this thing on our way into. Again with the Madison. vacuum cleaner. So if you're just sounds. joining, uh, folks. Uh... Oh, the ramp zone to getaway starts. Oh, well, there we go. Get All right. right. So you see the channel type exclamation point ticket. Get a ticket and um, uh, get yourself a ticket to the giveaway. We're giving away two free subs. Get off the right here. here. Subscriber here, I'll give you something to any channel on Twitch. We're doing the uh, Batsim, uh, they've got a uh, class Someone's Delta got a jet over here. thing going on tonight, and I think that's fantastic. We are doing some, uh, some Go ahead GA get the flying off on Batsim. I'm so happy that they're off. doing this, and uh, I always love GA events on Batsim. Kind of there quiet tonight, eight, there's not three much other traffic. Besides me and Moose, there's not much other traffic. Thank you very much. We'll go ahead and taxi down to that uh, notch we saw on the uh, on the final approach, so and we'll wait there for the Warrior for 683 Mike Bravo. So we're 683 Mike Bravo, uh, any idea on the ETA? Yeah, he's only about 24 miles out. All right, November 683 Mike Bravo. Uh, actually, can I have you taxi to that uh, last ramp on the north side there uh, and just exit uh, taxiway Alpha for now? Oh, uh, yeah, that's fine for 683 Mike Bravo. Puff knows that. Puff was here uh, back in the days when I only did GA flying. Where is that? Why am I hearing a... There's no one here. What am I, what am I hearing? I'm hearing this jet noise. That's why the A2A Cherokee and prepared. And now I'm flying the uh, Just Fly Cherokee in Microsoft Flight Simulator. Pull up the uh, the map here. So, oh, really there's an FBO right there at the okay. Fort Worth. So there's Victor, and then after Victor should be the FBO. Okay, um, where we got 20 miles to KADS. Uh, let me bring up the chart here. Oh, Scotty, I meant to tell you this. I tried to get the donut livery at work, and I couldn't get it working. And, in fact, it somehow got all my it got uh, the, all my other liveries right all here. wonky. So I had to reinstall the plane from scratch. I don't know what I did wrong. Uh, I installed the two files that you sent, and they didn't work, so I went back and I grabbed, grabbed that other uh, that it actually JSON should be further than that, but it doesn't look like it's modeled in the sim, so there. we're going to go And here. that kind of made it half work, but it still was all wonky. 
like everything was like uh, weird. So I, I don't know. Uh, I don't know if I did something wrong or uh, or what happened. But I, I tried to get the donut livery working and I couldn't get it working. Oh, K. Field, Rob Powell, how very kind of you. Thank you so much. Coming in with a 200-bit uh, cheer. The show love bits. All right. So we're going to sit here for a moment and KTL, wait Rob for Powell, some thank Caesar. You so much. i got to watch my altitude here. Last Bravo. Okay, it's 4,000 where we are, so I'm okay. <laughs> KTL Rob Powell coming in with another cheer for 45 bits. Thank you so much, KTL Rob Powell. Get the uh, ATIS. Okay, Moose, I'll let you pick. Uh, I don't know what your schedule is. Do you want to fly out to uh, to uh, TKI, or do you want to fly, keep going around the circle here to DTO? I'll let you pick which one you want to do. DTO. Yeah, Scotty, maybe that was it. Maybe Sim Update 8 uh, messed it up. All right, so apparently DTO. we're okay, going to do DTO. Uh, so uh, let's go ahead eight. and pull that up. It's, uh, we'll check it on the chart here first. So uh, DTO, we're sitting yeah, here at Addison. Uh, DTO's up here is good. Denton. So we're sitting chart. underneath a 2,500-foot uh, uh, shelf at the zero. moment. And flying straight there will take us into this 2,000-foot uh, shelf for a moment. It looks like we cut that corner there. Uh, so just want to be, well, again, we'll just stick below 1,500 feet, I think. So or stick, stick the, at 1,500. Uh, Excuse me. And uh, okay, so but then once we're out of that, we've got a 3,000-foot shelf. And then the Denton uh, airspace is sitting under a 4,000-foot shelf. You can see that there. Uh, so and then beyond that is another 4,000 foot shell. I don't know why that's distinct. Is there a, what's this over here? Oh, this is, that's why. This is a, wait a minute. Probably have enough room to make a right turn out, but we'll make the left turn out. Yeah, isn't this all 3,000 foot? 4,000, yeah. I don't know why they distinguish this, because this is all 4,000 here. This is the 5,000. So I don't know what the point of this is, because this is also 4,000, so go figure. Um, <laughs> just trying to make sure that, uh, but uh, anyway, so we, we should be fine going through here at uh, 1500 at, and we'll be safe. Uh, uh, we're going to have uh, control tower is going to be 1995 at Denton, so we'll put that in there. But I just, I just forgot. Uh, what, 1995? Yeah, Moose, yeah. thank you for your patience and uh, thank you for flying along. 13.6 miles. Fine. Everything's fine. Nineteen nine. Nineteen. Wait. Nine five. There we go. Right. Double check that. One 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 nine nine five. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So that's good there. Let's go ahead and do the direct. What happened there? It's like a fire or something. <laughs> Oh, thank you, LK. Uh, thank you, Rob. I appreciate that. Thank you for the nice words. I really appreciate it. There's no way to do this thank you for coming recycling. It's annoying. K. D. I'll tell you, the community here in the flight sim community here on Twitch is amazing. Absolutely amazing. K. D. T. Oh. Oh, there it was. Uh, Stug Shunt is here. Go. Good to see you. I need a name. 1564. Hello, Andrea. Yeah, see, if we if we go straight, we actually cut into that 2000. This this bit Folks, of the class Bravo is 2000. Get a ticket, so or you don't have to that. get a ticket. If you don't want to win, you don't You've have to get a ticket. You've got to be careful of that. I'm not forcing you to get a ticket. But so. uh, if you want to win, you have to get a ticket. So uh, you are forced to get a ticket if you want to win. We're giving away two subs to the Sim Caesar channel. And uh, if you're a winner and you're already a subscriber to the Sim Caesar channel, I'll give you a sub to any channel on Twitch. Even if you got a sub through a gift sub, even if somebody gifted you a sub, somebody like BuffMTD123, uh, if you got a gift sub from Ben and you're a winner, I'll still give you a gift sub to any channel on Twitch. It doesn't matter how Let's you do got this. a sub. Let's go KDTO. Uh, but if you're a winner and you're not a subscriber, you'll get a sub to my channel, so... 
So Denton has two runways. They're both uh, north-south, 18 left and right. We'll probably be on 18 left. And can I see the ATIS for Denton yet? Not from here. I don't see one listed, actually. Well, that's fine. Addison Tower, Cherokee, once your okay, Charlie is nine miles east, east uh, landing with information, Romeo. Addison Tower, Cherokee, one here Charlie, Charlie, Addison Tower, good evening. Uh, enter uh, left down one, runway 15. Left down one, runway 15, once your Charlie. Tower, good evening. Uh, enter left down one, runway 15. Left down one, runway 15, once your Charlie. That's 100%. Like real life, it's so much fun. So much fun. I love live ATC on uh, in flight sim. It's just, it was such a game changer for me. Uh, Moose, I'll do a touch and go. Okay. So it, I don't know if you've taxied back yet, but uh, I'm uh, eight miles out. I'm just getting to the Addison the Tower, uh, Cessna 683, my Bravo. That uh, What's all this? one Sierra Charlie is the aircraft we're waiting for. Addison Tower, uh, 683, Bravo, Mike Bravo, Bravo Red. One Sierra Charlie is the aircraft away. Remember 683 Mike Bravo, do you uh, same for after he read? It's a great day for flying. Uh, we're going to be uh, following him uh, north uh, east to uh, uh, Denton. Uh, we're going to be. Uh, following remember 683 Mike Bravo, would you like fly following? Uh, oh, uh, traffic. No, we don't need fly following for uh, 683 Mike Bravo. Remember 683 Mike Bravo, roger. Traffic. Uh, no, we don't need fly following for uh, 683 Mike Bravo. Okay, uh, Rob Powell, thank you so much. Thank you for your support, and thank you for the kind words, and thank you for coming by tonight. In some ways, that just makes it easier. Uh, now, in real life, in this airspace, and, uh, I would absolutely ask for flight following because there's going to be so much aircraft, another set of eyes. Why would you refuse that? But in the sim, who cares? <laughs> it's just more radios I have to uh, keep up with when I'm not in What's the Delta. So I get to be more free range. Ground stuff. The ATIS says visibility visibility 13. Yeah, I don't think so. Internal aircraft on frequency. Addison, ATIS information, Sierra. Now current winds 170 at 5. Altimeter 3031. Addison, ATIS information, Sierra. Now current winds 170 at 5. Altimeter 3031. Sneeze. Excuse me. 13 miles. Yeah, I don't think so. Not in the haze I saw coming in. More like What's 5 the, uh, miles. Conditions over at, uh, Oh, now the ATIS comes up over here, but yeah, it says 13. Number 722 Mike Alpha, Addison Tower, good evening. Enter, let's see, enter right down one runway 15. Right down one runway 15, and information you're up here. Let's see, enter right down one runway 15. Right down one runway 15, and information you're up here. That guy knows how to talk on the radio. Bowler 65 got a gift up from uh, T Bird 57. And, Once he gets uh, a little bit closer here, we'll by. request Bowler's a taxi back. Number 722 Mike Alpha. Uh, I'm going to have you That's do a enter left downward uh, from like 15. One five. I'm going to keep everybody on the same side. Number 722 Mike Alpha. Uh, or one Sierra Charlie, uh, are you doing uh, touch and go or you want full stop? Okay, uh, we'd like so our touch and go with a right Charlie, down and departure uh, if possible. One Sierra Charlie, doing, uh, touch and go or you want full stop? Uh, we'd like our touch and go with a right down and departure if possible. One Sierra Charlie, remember one Sierra Charlie, uh, let's see, hmm. actually, can you just make that a uh, let's uh, on the go make that a left uh, down and departure? Okay, uh, left down and departure on the go, and um, we're in, in coming in on the 45 once there, Charlie. Okay, uh, left down and departure Sierra on the Charlie, go. Charlie, runway and, um, 15, clear touch and go. 45 once there, Charlie. 15, clear touch and go, once there, Charlie. Clear touch and go, once there, Charlie. Charlie, runway 15, clear touch and go. 15, clear touch and go, once there, Charlie. Once he starts his downwind, we'll request a taxi to the end. Oh my gosh, 
the beach house is Adam here. Tower, beach house, what a nice surprise. Good to see you. How are you? Ray is with you We're doing some uh, GA flying on pilot edge. Or pilot edge. On Max. 417 Tango X-ray, Addison Tower. Good evening. Center left downwind runway 15. And thank you, 20 Tango. Left downwind runway 15. Center 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 left downwind for runway 15. Remember 417 Tango X-ray. Oh, I'm glad they're getting some more traffic. Addison Tower, uh, November 683, Mike Bravo. Could we uh, taxi to the end in uh, preparation for that uh, one zero, Charlie? Addison Tower, uh, November 683, Mike Bravo, runway 15, taxi by Alpha. 15 by Alpha, 683, Mike Bravo. Number Sorry to hear that beach house, but good to see you tonight. Number 417 Tango X ray, maintain VFR at or above 1500 until passing the extended runway center line. At or above 1500, or sorry, 1500 until passing the runway center line for 417 Tango X ray. Uh, Boulder 65, yes, indeed. 722 Mike Alpha traffic, uh, your 12 o'clock, same direction. Yeah, see, this should have been the FBO here, but there's no, uh, like, taxiway. A Piper Warrior went off at uh, 1,300, report and say. Well, that looks like a business that's not even related to the airport. I don't know what happened there. According to the chart, there's an FBO right here. Nag. Number 722 Mike Alpha, maintain visual separation. Runway 15, third left. Addison Tower, one Sierra Charlie. Were we cleared for the option? Yes, you were. Number one Sierra Charlie, runway one five, clear for the option. Addison Tower, one Sierra Charlie. the option, and we'll be doing a left uh, downwind after that. One Sierra Charlie. One five, clear for the option, and we'll be doing a left uh, downwind after that. One Sierra Charlie. All right. Couldn't remember if he cleared me. Better to check. You know what I'm saying? And Addison Tower, 3 Mike Bravo, holding short, runway 15, oh, ready to go after the 10 Charlie. 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 You'll call my base for the Tango X-ray. There's Sim. There he is. You know, what looks like a TBM, but he's actually in a Piper Warrior, but apparently I don't have a Piper Warrior for model matching, so. <laughs> it looks like a TBM. And it looks like he's landing long, but there's a bit of an extended threshold. You can see the green lights for the beginning of the runway right over there, so he's not really. He's actually landing right in the touchdown zone, it looks like. Get the stall warning horn. But. Like butter. Like butter. Like a big stick of butter. Oh, we got this guy coming in right here, too. Oh, dang. Sam, you better get moving there, pal. What can you do? Nice. Nice. Not thrilling. Okay, he's off, yeah. Nice. Toga! Toga! We're going to make a left downwind departure, and then we're going to... Whoops. DTO. Oh, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> what the heck was Almost that? ended the stream. Number 722, Mike Alpha. Welcome to uh, Addison. To, Exit uh, left when able to taxi to parking by Alpha. Okay. ADTO. All right. Exit when able with that. We'd like to get in a taxi back in possible. Number 722, Mike Alpha. Runway 15. Taxi by Alpha. Uh, one five, the alpha, the two five, 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 two five
And uh, Slabadanks, thank you so Almost much. Gifting a tier one sub to uh, it's L A L T H D. Thank you so much. Tier one here, Charlie. Traffic oh, really at that. your thank eleven you so o'clock, uh, three miles, opposite direction. Uh, a hyper hyper warrior, I believe, uh, and lose uh, one thousand for the fight. Uh, negative contact. We're looking much here, Charlie. Here, Charlie, traffic at one and a half mile, 1,000. I don't see him. I feel like I should see him, but I don't see him. Still no contact. One here, Charlie. Traffic at one and a half mile. So we're 417 Tango X ray, runway 15, clear to land. Clear to land, runway 15, 417 Tango X ray. I swear my lights are on. Uh, Alright, left downwind departure. Number 523 Hotel here, Addison Tower, good evening. Uh, enter left downwind runway 15. Thank you so much for the gift sub. And we're going to again, we'll extend the crosswind a little bit just to get clear of the airport. Number 722 Mike Alpha, St. Hudson. Thank you so, so much. Keep an eye out for Sue Caesar, he looks like he's already passed. Number 722 Mike Alpha, Roger. Let me see who else I haven't said. It's LTHD uh, is here. Thanks so much for coming by. Uh, Boulder 65. Uh, 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 well, we're not down a little bit. Left I realize we're climbing a little higher than I wanted to. Left traffic, 417 Tango X-ray. Alright, there we go. Number 1 Sierra Charlie, leave my airspace to the north. Frequency change approved. Have a great flight. Thanks so much for the ATC and the event today, once here, Charlie. Thanks so much for the ATC and the event today once here, Charlie. Number 22, Mike Alpha, make left downwind departure, runway 15, let's take off. Number 22, Mike All right, Alpha, let's great event today, take really, really, take really take happy with this, this is so cool. Okay, right, we're going to uh, KDTO. KDTO. Alright, we're going to go ahead and go direct now, so... Watch out for that. this. Okay, I want to avoid this space over here. Let's go ahead out over the lake here. That's probably a better idea. Ooh, Tom. Flies 787. Blue Mata battery, yes it is. It's the TDS GTN. Uh, highly, highly recommended. Uh, fly 7873 Hotel Sierra traffic 11 o'clock, 4 miles, opposite direction, turning downwind. A uh, hyper warrior 1500 report site. Okay. Uh, you're and we should be good uh, under the shelf uh, here. Uh, there five, two, three, the hotel Sierra maintain uh, visual separation. Yeah, it's 2500, so we're good at 15 minutes. Uh, there's a GA event on that same time. And we're doing. We're 417 Tango uh, X ray. Uh, let's see, maintain uh, VFR at a below 2000. Uh, he can uh, exit the uh, left down one right there. All right, at a below 2000. Easy, easy, easy. Left down one for 417 Tango X ray. We're 722 Mike Alpha traffic at your 3 o'clock or correct, 9 o'clock, uh, half okay. a mile. Now we're uh, uh, 60 miles. Uh, All right. Hyper uh, Warrior 1700 uh, report and say. There's a G event on Batson tonight, 11 Tower Airports, 11 Glasgow, and Tower Airports. And uh, I'm hitting about uh, 7 or 8 or 9 of them, maybe. And Moose is flying along. 683 Mike Bravo, leaving my airspace to the north. Frequency change to advisory approved. All right, frequency change approved for 683 Mike Bravo. Thanks for the ATC and great event. Server 523 Hotel Sierra, you can just uh, continue to enter. Alright, we're going to go ahead and switch over now to Denton. Uh, not that we're going to be there anytime soon, but we'll get ready. Denton, if uh, I recall correctly, is a, yeah, 1-8 uh, left. 
able to come by as much as I know And I don't like think to. we had a... Of course, not as much as I wish he could. Yeah, I don't see a uh, uh, Aegis for that. Really special when we do get a sea. So. Which is surprising, but I'm sure the weather is very similar to the weather that we've had everywhere since we're not flying very far away. Towers not on? It should be. No, so I'm not oh. showing the. Uh, oh, you're right. I don't see me. I don't see the ATIS and I don't see the tower online. They're supposed to be online for the event. I don't see either. They're listed as one of the airports, but uh, I don't see them uh, as on being online. Changing course here, AFW. Uh, let me check the, uh, the sectional, make sure we're not going to violate anything if we go over there. That's Alliance. And this is 2000. I think we're above that spot. We're actually right here. So we go direct Alliance. We should be good to stay out of the, uh, the surface. So yeah, AFW, okay. So we're good. Let's go direct. Play the puff sound again. <laughs> Can I do, uh, if I just do now, that go there? Yep. So use the GPS to our advantage. Why not? Ooh, that was strange. Then it seemed to like shake for a moment. <laughs> Context. This is what we're watching right now. <laughs> this is the Puff MTD theme that Simpsons is playing on the stream. Since you guys heard that before, you might as well see what we're talking about. Oh, it's hilarious. There's somebody right there. That well, looks like an airliner. I don't think that's Sim. <laughs> I hope not anyway. I think that's an airliner. Yeah, in fact, it probably is going into Fort Worth because we're crossing over the center now. Fort Worth is, is right down there. So we're in the, uh, the, this is a 2000 shelf, I believe, the Fort Worth Center. Yes. So yeah, we gotta stay below our uh, 2000, or we'll be in a world of trouble. But that keeps us out of the approach path, safely. state there. I've flown into Dallas Fort Worth but I've never been to Dallas. I mean I've never well that's not true. I've left the airport on an airport oh, sorry, shuttle sorry, sorry, to a no, hotel that was yeah, just off the, the airport but bomb. beyond that yeah, <laughs> I haven't uh, been to time ever, a four minute, um, Oh shoot uh, I need to get the uh, the tower frequency for Alliance here. That is uh, 13515. First time that's ever happened. I, I made this alert for like a 50 gift sub bomb thinking I figured if I just keep streaming long enough, someday somebody will. And uh, 
today was the day. And uh, Puff uh, did, did it. 50 gift subs. All right, so there we go. 13515. Let me make sure that tracks with uh, Alliance Tower 13515. Yep. And there is an ATIS for Alliance. That is information Delta. Winds are 160 at 7, 10 miles. Clear, 3029. So it's going to be roughly there. Yeah, so far all the tower frequencies have matched the chart, which has been really cool. Um, Alright, so we've got that. I need to pull up Alliance on the chart here. KFW, Alliance Fort Worth, and that is... All right, we got uh, one sixes, one six left and right. So probably one six left based on the approach lights, but who knows? Uh, it really doesn't matter. We're GA. They're both eleven thousand feet long, so plenty. Tom, good, really great to see a Trace EV. Welcome. There's a big uh, Amazon hub, Air Hub uh, cargo apron, and a big FedEx cargo ramp apron. So this is where all the this is, the Alliance is where all the uh, air cargo there. comes in for the to, Dallas uh, area. Post some mod love uh, emotes in the chat for Pop. I think I had my mic. There. Oh, uh, I'm 12 miles from Alliance really at the moment. Boy, the scenery is fantastic. I love this. Ten miles from. Why are they giving the map that he's like talking about? Ten miles. <laughs> so it's going to be a, a really. Tight, you can see uh, Fort Worth out there in the distance, the, the airport, Dallas Fort Worth. Okay, uh, the elevation seventeen twenty seven twenty three. So we uh, make sure I'm at seventeen hundred. Oh, gotta get down a little bit. And let me call. This is uh, uh, Fort Worth. All right, so there is the uh, the delta there. Yeah, the airspace for this is uh, up to uh, up to, but not including, three thousand feet. Alliance Tower Turkey One Sierra Charlie is nine miles north east, landing with Delta. Alliance Tower Turkey One Sierra Charlie. Is nine Turkey One Sierra Charlie. Alliance Tower Roger report uh, left down there, running one six left. Uh, you can't even get left base for One Sierra Charlie. I'm sure, uh, Charlie, correction, I'm sure, uh, uh, report left, left base, base running one six left. We'll report left base, one six left, one sure, Charlie. Correction, I'm sure, uh, report left base, running one six left. We'll report left base, one six left, one sure, Charlie. And Tower, Nevo uh, Cessna 683 Mike Bravo at, uh, 1500, about seven and a half yeah, miles Alliance east, Tower, uh, uh, requesting, base, uh, touch and go at Alliance. Cessna uh, 6 a three mic broad the line tower uh, rod enter a left downwind for only one six left enter left downwind for only one six left six eight three mic bravo Ooh, we got a low fuel light we still actually have quite a bit of fuel though this is Got uh, what is that? About eight gallons each side. We're not going very far. That's plenty. 
I think we can do this whole circuit on half tanks. I think. Anything we can stop. We're going to uh, Fort Worth next. Uh, so this guy here, Fort Worth uh, Meacham. So we can always get gas there if we need to. But once we hit that one, if we uh, head back down to Fort Worth Spinks, we've made the full circuit. I don't know if he's going to go back to Spinks or if he's going to. Okay, there's the airport right there. Or if he's going to stop at Meacham or, or if he'll go over here to uh, Fort Worth uh, Naval Air Station. Yeah. Also, technically a Delta. Oh, did you get uh, it in the DC-6? Meacham is 118.3, uh, oh, so let's get that queued is it, up. Is this? So at least we have that, 118. Which, uh, somebody, okay, who was it that said that I'd be crossing over the uh, NASCAR track? Which, cra which track is this? NASCAR track? Oh. Uh, oh, oh, yeah, yeah, two, okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it'll work in anything, but it won't integrate into the virtual cockpit. One eighteen three. But yeah, if you've got a special and uh, is this that a Texas is Texas Motor Speedway. KFTW. This is the one, huh? I bet you get a lot of jets over here into uh, Alliance on the race weekend. And then what's the? Do we have any issues with airspace there? We're in the. Looks like we're in a 4,000 foot, sh under a 4,000 shelf here. So yeah, we're fine. That airspace goes up to 3-2. And we just got to stay clear of the uh, Naval Air Station airspace. Okay. Okay. All right, we're entering a downwind, so we're going to keep uh, plugging away to the airport. We're about two miles oh, they've got a from really, the field. They've got we'll it, start uh, turning here in just a second. Cherokee, once your Charlie's on the left base, one six left. Check one zero Charlie at Roger wind one six zero at seven running one six plus clear to land. Uh, can we get a um, uh, touch and go with a straight out departure for one zero Charlie? Check uh, one zero Charlie a, uh, Roger. Would you like uh, VFR departure to the south? Uh, yeah, VFR departure to the south. Negative flight following one zero Charlie. Check one zero Charlie Roger one six plus clear touch and go VFR departure to the south of Bridge. Once you left there, touch and go with a VFR departure to the south. Once you're Charlie. There's some Caesar right there. Once you left there, touch and go with a VFR departure to the south. Once you're Charlie. Well, I'm Tower Good Evening, FedEx 1517, heavy on the visual once they left. Or maybe that's FedEx. FedEx 1517, heavy. Well, that's Tower Roger, when 160 at 700, 16 left, no land. Good land, 16 left, FedEx 1517, heavy. Might be the FedEx. Yeah, it looks like it. I see bigger landing lights looking there. I think that's FedEx. Okay, we're gonna. So we're gonna keep our downwind going here because obviously we don't want to end up in front of him. Well, it looks like one six left has a big displaced threshold. Uh, Cherokee one zero was Gary, but uh, take running one six right. Is that for one zero Charlie? And uh, if so, yes, we can sign it up. At uh, Cherokee one zero Charlie, run turning one six right, clear to go. One six right, clear to go. One zero Charlie. At Cherokee one zero Charlie, run turning one six right, clear to go. And Alliance Tower, Cessna six eight three Bravo. We're on the uh, left downwind. I think this is the FedEx just off of our uh, nine o'clock. That's up to 680 Bravo affirmative. Uh, re remain uh, clear of the traffic and uh, extend down one. I will call your base. Okay, we'll remain clear of the traffic, extend down one. We'll wait for you to call our base for 683 Bravo. process of that we've now left the <laughs> this class delta <laughs> but that's okay we 
Yeah, we're uh, touch and go if possible for a straight out uh, departure to the south for 683 Mike Bravo. 683 Mike Bravo, runway 16 left, clear touch and go southbound departure. Alright, clear touch and go, 16 left, southbound departure approved for 683 Mike Bravo. Where will you be parking today? Meacham, I just met him. Power Cessna 172 Delta, go ready to touch it. The airman ship is not... 172 Delta, I ask uh, where are you located. Gives me distress. Uh, the uh, terminal would be over here. Uh, Meacham Tower, Turkey, 172 right, Delta, I go on our 162 Delta, back to the aisle. Okay, 160 via Alpha, 2 Delta, go. Medic 1517, attack to the ranch by Alpha Hotel. Alpha Hotel to the ramp, Medic 1515, Alright, there's the airport, we see the beacon. There's where the beacon comes in handy. I think we're a little well, bit watch beyond this, watch our space. Direct to. Let me check my own. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Direct to. There. Course to. 160. Enter. Activate. Extended center. Yeah, that's the 172 <laughs> Delta Echo. Give way to a FedEx 777. Actually, that's stupid. Because I already got these right extended on center Alpha. lines here. Yeah, I see that. Um, I see that FedEx right there too. Uh, a good point. If we were farther away, then I would. Uh, that would be uh, a handier little uh, tip. But uh, all right, where are we going to go after this? Um, let's go back. Uh, let's go back to where we started. KFWS. We'll, we'll have made the full circuit. KFW Kilo Foxtrot Whiskey Sierra. since we're so far outside the airspace. See, this, this thing was throwing me off. The, the way that it was drawn, the line, it made it look like a strobe in, so I was thinking I was further off to the side, but I was not.
wants to uh, meet your mom. Stupid FedEx threw off my uh, <laughs> threw off my plan. One six left. There's two here. We want to make sure we land on the correct runway. Right runway here. Oh no no, it is a strobe in. One six uh, meter one six. I wasn't making that up. You're coming in from the north. There's a football field down there. Six is over here. Check that out. Football. I mean, it's much bigger than the other one. High school so, uh, field probably. You just land on the bigger one and everything. See, there's one seven over here. All right, here's Alliance. Caution wake turbulence, although by now it should have dissipated. It's been a few minutes. But we'll still be cautious of a bit. I don't know how much that's simulated in the sim. I feel like I've, I've felt sorry, wake turbulence in the sim before from that sim after taking off out of a, oh, there's the triple seven. Look at that, it even looks like FedEx. Model magic's working. I feel like uh, we, we took off one time out of uh, Las Vegas behind somebody. I don't remember if that was through Vatson or that was just multiplayer. Oh my gosh, so Ray, 757, what a night. It's a great night tonight, and uh, it just got even greater. 757 Spy coming in with a raid. 757 Spy, hello, how are you? Welcome on in. We're, um, there's a GA event tonight on Vatsim. Uh, we're doing it at 11. Can you believe this? I bet you won't, but you can't. But you're not going to believe this when I tell you. They got 11 class Delta air, uh, airports all manned all around. Uh, well, not really, because DTO wasn't and we're, manned. Uh, we're supposed doing to be. a tour. I'm not hitting every single one of them, but I'm hitting. Uh, we're, we're hitting about. Uh, I think we're going to hit eight of them. Eight or nine of them. And. Uh, Let's go! Tonight, if you're just joining, type exclamation point ticket. Get yourself a ticket to the giveaway. We're giving away two free subs to the Sim Season right, channel. And, and we're if you're off. Winner, you're already a subscriber. I'll give you a sub to any channel on Twitch. It's, it's, it's Bravo. Class Delta. It's a very classy event. Frequency change approved. Thank you so much for the ATC so, uh, and a great event yeah, for Cessna 6831 Bravo. Uh, 757 spy my gosh it's been a wonderful wonderful night and this uh, just uh, this is like the icing on the cake to get a raid from uh, one of our dear friends and the sim caesar flight sim streamer do this whole hand flying this thing 757 spy well i'm going to have a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a huge airplane down there. And a little airplane. There's two airplanes. Delta 172, Delta, extra rougher, wind is 1607, fly runway heading. Actually, uh, this car. Uh, wind 1607, runway 1, left, click takeoff. Click takeoff, uh, runway 16 left, uh, with a runway heading 2 Delta. And 2 Delta, echo, disregard, runway heading. Fly on course. So he's doing his touch and go right now into, uh, Meacham. So we're not that far behind. We're only 9 miles behind him now, but just happened. FTW. ATIS information Foxtrot 3030 That tower, did you disregard my, my clearance to uh, take off? Two dots ago. And our two dots as jump back to negative. You're still uh, clear for takeoff. Just disregard the runway heading. And two dots, uh, the clear for takeoff runway one six left. Uh, two dots ago. Thank you. I'm trying to stay below. 15 or below 2,000. Don't really need to at this point, but kind of just it's safer. <laughs> okay, uh, we're on our to our last one. Are we on? Yeah, this is three of them, I think. So I think we hit 18. Three is me. Chuck, we're going back to the one here. Our work is KFWS. Right, FTW. We have takeoff on course departure A with the Sierra. Speaks. Meacham Tower, 
Cessna 683 Mike Bravo is about seven miles to the north, looking for a touch and go departure to the south. Cessna 683 Mike Bravo is about seven miles to the north. Cessna 683 Mike Bravo meets Howard. Landing straight in runway 16, report five mile final. Straight in runway 16, report five mile final for Cessna 683 Mike Bravo. Let me say hello to some folks here. Uh, Geekle Twitch. Well, we said hi to Geekle Twitch. Yeah, we'll say hi again because I love Geekle Twitch. Thank you for coming by. Trip Taker is here and 757 Spy. Thank you so much. For so the there's way. our runway right there. Yeah, we that's Moose. He's been flying along all night. It's very kind of him to fly along. I thought I was hoping we have more people flying along tonight for a GA event on that zip, but um, uh, in fact, we didn't have any people at all. The only person, the only, the only one flying along was a Moose. This is the big one. Okay. Well. There goes Sim oh, Caesar. Boy, cannot beat Microsoft. Star four nine four Julie. I think that's him anyway. Point for my one biggest temperature check pattern. And uh, yeah, seven fifty seven spy. I'm using the TDS GTN seven fifty. This thing is for Julie Alpha. Absolutely fantastic. Really, really love this. Right, close seven from the one six to take off one out for the Right, close seven from the one six to take off one out for the And Meacham Tower, Cessna 683 Mount Bravo is five uh, miles on the visual, runway one six. Conti did an epic hot tub stream. Like a real, real hot tub, yeah, like a real hot tub. And, uh, and uh, They kind of trailed off their uh, tower. What was that for a 683 my brother? Delivery 3 May Bravo, River 1 6. Can we have the uh, touch and go for 1 6? River 3 May Bravo, River 1 6. the option. 1 6, uh, 683 my brother. Thanks. He's kind of mumbling there. It's not helping, but. 624625, 124625. Are we out of there, Class Delta? Yes, we are. So we can go to frequency 24625. Transfer. And this, the name of this airport is Dyna. No, the name of this <laughs> airport is Spinx. I should know that. Dyna. That's where we took off from. It's in the kitchen with Dyna. Spinx. This whole thing, Spinx. And we're going to Spinx after this, where we, uh, from whence we came. And that is FWS, and that's uh, roughly straight out from where we were. So oh, Moose, I'm so happy you flew along with me tonight. This is really, really nice. Nice to have company, you know? I'm going to do a quick uh, Q400 flight on Pilot Edge after this. It really has. I wish they'd do more events like these, but... Uh, it doesn't sound like any they were getting much traffic for this, which is really sad. These uh, Airbus uh, is a, a folks that fly Airbus all the time don't know what they're missing flying one of these little propeller planes. Look at that! Oh, trains! Oh, that must be the Alliance uh, train yard right there. Oh no, it's that'd a be up yard. Tar. There's a rail yard right here too. Look at this, right here by Meacham. We're still about five gallons in each side, so we'll be fine to spink. So yeah, we're, we're going to do this no problem without having to refuel, like I thought. Thirty one zero Charlie, Roger, make uh, straight in, runway one uh, eight right. Like I thought. So hopefully having the uh, Sim Caesar stream going because we're flying with him hasn't been too distracting. I, this yeah, this video is kind of just a uh, an experiment to see what kind of uh, but, you know, that's what thoughts we get on uh, YouTube here. Is, uh, I'm thinking about whenever I do these little offline flights I'm and our stream is recording them and then having the step, step a ability to put them up. Your regular box, you know, there's a uh, there's a lot of great stuff to do in flight simming besides uh, you know just. Um, Tower, twin commercial Piper, ops in the Airbus and all that. There's a lot of great stuff. Piper, one, and one, you got Microsoft uh, Flight Simulator now. You can't eat. This is a GA dream here. So. Go. We go down. And throttle up. Air correction.
coming on full oh, Juliet Alpha. Turning to the final of the one thing. Four Juliet Alpha runway. Beach and Tower, November 0817. Am I clear to switch to regional approach? First part. Uh, Contact departure one one eight point one. Eight point one eight point seven Sierra. Maybe not in sight. flying this whole time. <laughs> I'll use the automation a little bit. This has been really a fun event though, man. I'm not really that big of a GA flyer on the flight sim, but when you got like a little mission like this to do, these little short hops, it's really fun. That's the traffic right and the, the visuals make it really good, although this looks like a, a overgrown city of despair over here at <laughs> this distance. Some of these skyscrapers always looks funny because they're trying their best to do automatic 3D modeling and it comes up kind of funny. Oh, Skyman wants to know what I'm flying. Okay, I got three potential runways. <laughs> I'm not sure which is the runway. I got three potential runways here. I think these might be taxiways. Look at the chart, Sim Caesar. That will solve your problem. Uh, Alright, what was the frequency for Sphinx? Uh, yeah, we're good. 4,000. Oh, yeah, we're fine. Uh, 124625 is the... Alright, we're outside their airspace. He didn't clear me out of the radio range, but I'm, I don't need so to. He doesn't technically need to tell me that. So that was the, we're going to switch over to Sphinx now. Supposed to be watching. And here's somebody coming over the and, top. Uh, apparently he didn't know where he was. And just keep visual with that guy. Back we're back uh, we're below. Be we're 1,200 feet. Roger, Romeo, No delay, runway 1A right clear for takeoff. Yes, indeed. 57 spot. Roger, make right traffic for 1A right. So if you're ever not sure if he's coming toward me or away from me, see the green light is on the left for me? That means he's coming at me. That's an airliner, it looks like. It's going kind of slow, though. That might just be a model match issue. Wind check? It's probably the, the, One, two, three, uh, eight, GA. But yeah, the uh, the red light is always on the left side. So when you see it on your one left, one four, if you see it, you traffic, uh, uh, if you see the red light on your on left, then he's right. going the same direction as you are. If you yeah, see it on your right, right four, like I did just now, then we know he's going toward me. Roger, one one four, but you probably will follow that traffic in one eight right. All right, follow the traffic in for one eight right. One four, pop. Far are we are eight miles from uh, from uh, Sphinx. Piper one one four whiskey Papa. Uh, is this a uh, full stop landing? Oh, yeah, that's a full stop. So we have two runways here, eighteen uh, right and left. And it looks like the left one is turf. Runway one eight right, third land. Third land one eight right one four Papa. Sure, if you want to hear Charlie, say park. Uh, we'll go to the uh, FBO near Echo once you're Charlie. Say park. Roger, once you're Charlie uh, to the ramp via Delta the, Alpha. Uh, FBO ramp via Delta Alpha once you're Charlie. 
Sphinx Tower, it's a Cessna 683 Mike Bravo, is about six and a half miles to the north at 1500, looking for full stop landing at Sphinx. Cessna 683 Mike Bravo, make straight in, uh, multiple traffic in the pattern. Make straight in, and I've got uh, a number of the, the aircraft in sight for 683 Mike Bravo. Peter Mooney, what did you do? Peter Mooney, what have you done? Oh my. Zero five zero six Bravo Romeo Romeo one eight right clear for the option. The option right. uh, I think this is our runway right here. We're gonna bank off a little bit over here. And Sphinx Tower. Uh, Sphinx Tower Cherokee seven eight seven Fox about five more. Uh, Sphinx to land. Uh, Sphinx Sphinx Tower Cherokee seven eight seven Fox about five more. Seven eight seven Fox uh, Lima make oh, straight in runway one eight right. Traffic is falling is a Cessna uh, on about a uh, four mile final when we went eight right. Four traffic is high. Okay, straight in one eight right for the traffic uh, box. Four traffic is high. That sounds like uh, Fly 77 is coming in behind me. That's awesome. It's Fly 787. 114 with your car. Uh, we'll go straight ahead to the ramp. Let me see if I can control the. I was before we should probably uh, touch the ramp the echo. Ramp the echo before it's possible. I uh, decided to ditch my uh, Xbox controller. Ramp the echo before And I've been, you, I switched that. I will kill the autopilot. I said some people were in command. Today's Fox Lima. Cessna traffic is in Cessna 132. Should be on the left wing. Today's Fox Lima. Cessna Fox Lima, we have a full up. Kind of forming a right base here, we'll tuck it back. So, uh, Roger, Fox, uh, Lima, make, uh, maintain visual separation. You'll be number two, Falmouth. Number two, Falmouth, Cessna, uh, Fox, Lima. Maintain visual separation. You'll be number two, Falmouth. Cessna 683, Mike Bravo, runway 18 right, clear to land. 18 right, clear to land, 3 Mike Bravo. Cessna 683, Mike Bravo, runway 18 right, clear to land. 18 right, clear to land, 3 Mike Bravo. Glad to see they have so much traffic. This is awesome. Who was that? Was that? Fly 787. Oh my gosh, two face disc. Oh, what a nice surprise. Good to see a two face. Welcome on in. All right, and so we're going to be coming off the FBO so as well. That is the effects are we can make the first GA flying the on, first uh, taxiway. That will take us straight yeah, there to the FBO. That's not the first one, the uh, second one. First one's oh, Delta. Oh, Delta Echo. And, uh, we really enjoyed it. We're waiting for Moose to come in. And was this Fly 787? Was this you? I wasn't paying attention. Bravo Romeo. Uh, make right down with departure to the north approved. Oh, that was you, good right fixings? Right down with departure to the north approved. Make right down with departure to the north approved. Right down with departure to the north approved. I think this is Moose. Moose, is if, if this is you, say something. Make a moose noise. 683 Mike Bravo, it's me. <laughs> I don't know what noise a moose makes, to be honest. 683 Mike Bravo, uh, uh, taken. Sorry, disregard. I was trying to let someone know. Oh, there, I was that's landing. what the. the... <laughs> All right, it's the moose, uh, moose landing. Number 787 Foxtrot Lima. You're number two to land. Winds 16007 knots. Runway 18 right. Good land. Good, good. Good, good. good to land. Uh, 18 right at uh, 75. Beautiful, nice, oh, butter, very buttery. Very buttery, and now we've got uh, Fly 787 coming in. Yeah, November 683, Mike Bravo, you can make right on Echo to the ramp. Right on Echo to the ramp for three, three Mike Bravo, thanks. Like butter. It's called Charlie, which is a lie, but okay. Good old flight sim oh, shoot. taxiway markings that are wrong. Okay. Number Sometimes it just taxis Lima on its own. Uh, one eight right, right the long parking runway. Did I forget to set the parking brake? One eight right yeah, is the long runway. The long paved runway. Grass runway is off to the left. Long runway. 
Got it. Thank you. Turn so my strobes and my landing light off. Turn taxi light off too. So I'm blind. Sim. Fuel pump can go off now. Better, you better check the, you know, then be sorry and land on the wrong runway. There's Sim. We'll go pull up next to him. Here he comes, Fly 787 coming in, looking good. Fly 787 coming in, a jetliner. Looking good in his, whatever that thing is. I, I don't know. I have a feeling it's not an actual uh, Airbus, but. Uh, beautiful landing, beautiful landing. I'm not sure what the uh, Fly 77 is actually flying, but doesn't matter. A cub, okay, that would make sense. <laughs> That's a big cub. <laughs> there we go, there's Sim next to us with no landing gear. That's a nice touch. Tom, I'm parked near Echo. Oh, look, we got a bunch of people parked on the field here. This is fantastic. All right. And with that, we are going to kill the engine. Sorry, I said. 787 Fox Lima, say parking. We're gonna park over. There we go. We are down. Oh, where is Sim going? Oh, he's gonna do his donuts now. This is, uh, <laughs> for those of you that are uninitiated with Sim Caesar, this is the uh, ritual uh, uh, donuts that they that he likes to do after the stream. <laughs> they do this on the ramp where they're uh, technically out of ATC uh, control, so it's going to run me over. That little jerk just ran me over. <laughs> My immersion! All right, I think I'm gonna cut the uh, the, the uh, recording here. And uh, if you guys enjoyed uh, coming, uh, you know, maybe doing this, this GA thing. I mean, it will probably, I'll probably I might, we might do some more of this too. But uh, uh, I'm, I think I'm gonna try whenever I get a chance to fly with yeah, people like Simsies or whatever off uh, off stream to record and then make them uh, videos uh, for the YouTube channel. So uh, we can kind of build that. Uh, that content back up again. I have been doing the uh, the, uh, the the cat ratings on, on Pilot Edge too. When they're all done, I'm going to compile those into a a playlist for the YouTube channel as well. So so keep an eye out for those at some point. I like that. Just like that poor van is being. Uh, I, like that. I don't know what the word is. All right, guys. Hey, thanks for uh, checking it out. If you if you enjoyed the video, uh, uh, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Uh, it'll really help the channel. You can check me out live on Twitch at uh, twitch.tv forward slash Mustafa. And uh, <laughs> you can see some more of this kind of malarkey. But, uh, goodness, yeah. <laughs> anyway, thanks for checking it out and bearing with me. And uh, this is just kind of a fun spur of the moment. Hey, I'll hit the record button and see what happens. So I'm not going to really edit this out. <laughs> They're trying to get me to do donuts. All right, you know what? Fine. Fine, 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 fine. Hang on, let me get back in the thing and get the... do donuts in this thing. Just, oh, here comes Moose. It just goes off the rails and stopped going anywhere. <laughs> I can't do anything. Moose headed into the grass. <laughs> well, donuts are not my forte. normal for a moose, right? Donuts are not my he's forte. Getting, so he's hungry after the flight. He wants to get the grass. This thing doesn't do. I only want stupid engine and I can't. Oh, oh, what the? Oh, hello. That's a building. <laughs> I don't know how to back up. <laughs> oh no, Moose, what happened? <laughs> 
Thing. This is what flying with friends is all about, guys. This is where it's at. This is uh, the flight sim camaraderie right here. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna turn the game sounds down here. I don't know about that. <laughs> Gonna mute this out. Touching aircraft. Information. Julian, now turn wind 1607 knots. Oh, okay, 23. Touching aircraft. Information. Julian, now turn wind 1607 knots. That is hilarious. All right. All right. Good I'm seriously gonna cut this now. So. I wonder what this guy's thinking. Melvin Lee. Have a uh, have a good one. We'll uh, again hit that uh, like and subscribe button if you don't mind. I'd appreciate it. And uh, we'll see you on the next one. And come visit Twitch sometime if you've never checked out. It's 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 worth a check out. So, oh, oh my gosh. Okay, goodbye.